Alright, what's going on dudes and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you a tutorial on Hamachi. I'm not sure. Mm, well, if you if you have that problem, you're obviously here for the video. So, um, Hamachi, if you, if you have a problem that says, um, failed to connect to engine and this is a 100% working fix. Now, some computers, I've had this issue with some of my friends when I try to help them. They say that some of them um, actually don't have that button. So I'm sorry if they don't have that button. I don't necessarily know any other fix for this. But I know this one. So um, let's go ahead and move on. This wallpaper is in my video. So you can go ahead and check that out. But um, first of all, you want to just... I'm just going to show you what it's going to say. It's going to starting Hamachi and... I'm sorry if my voice sounds a little glum, it just because I'm kinda of sick. I'm kinda of sick at this moment. I was gonna say failed to connect engine, that's kind of uh you're kind of worried about that. Nothing to worry about. So once you go there, go ahead and type in run and just press enter and you should come to this little program here. And then you're gonna type in services.msk. Um I might zoom in right now and to show you this. So services.msk, um, maybe I should actually type it in like a Word document or something. Actually, no, you know, services.msk, okay? Services, all simple, dot msk, c, msc, sorry, msc, and go ahead and press OK. And you will get this menu with all this stuff. Now, instead of going down and finding Logmin Hamachi here, just click on anything and just press L. And then the second one, whatever it is, go and find it there. And it should say start the service here. And go ahead and click on that. Now, if it says stop service or restart service, this means you have already the tunneling engine has been initiated. So it should work for you. I do not know what the other problem is, but it should work. So if it does say start the engine, go ahead and click it and this program will appear and stop the service and restart the service will come instead of start the server so go ahead and close this and go ahead and go back to your hamachi and it should work like it did for me so you can see it is perfectly working out for me I don't know why I extended mine to see so big but yeah it is working perfectly fine for me there are my stuff there's nothing nothing faulty here it's working perfectly. So that's the fix for um, the Logbean Hamachi tunneling engine problem. Now, if you have any other problems with this, which I haven't already discussed, between the video, oh, I'm having a headache. Oh, God. But anyways, if you have any problems that I haven't discussed in the video, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Um, a rating will be highly appreciated. And that's it for now, guys. Um... Until next time, I guess I'll see you again. This background is in the um in one of my videos. I'll leave a link or an annotation right now, right around here, um somewhere. I'll leave an annotation when it's done uploading to show you. Um, when you just click on it, you can just go ahead and go to the video. It's probably up right now. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and quickly preview the other two backgrounds, and I will be saying goodbye. Alright, here's another background which is green and the other one is also light green, but I'm not going to waste time showing you both of these. So anyways guys, thanks for watching and goodbye.